Welcome to OCI. Today, we are going through the steps to mount an object storage bucket as a file system in Linux Server. Before you begin, ensure that object storage policies are added under the root compartment. Please check the video description for the documentation. For this demo, I have used an Oracle Linux Compute instance. Also, I have already created the object storage bucket. To view it, let's go to OCI Console Storage Object Storage and Archive Storage Buckets. We need to first create a secret key. Click on the profile icon in the top right corner and select User Settings. Click Customer Secret Keys and then click Generate Secret Key. Give the key a name and then click Generate Secret Key. Copy and save the secret key because it won't be shown again. The S3 credentials are created using access key and secret keys. The access key is displayed in the customer secret keys area of the console. To confirm the object storage namespace, click on the profile icon and select Tenancy, Object Storage Settings, object storage namespace. Note, for some old tenancies, namespace is the same as the tenancy name. Please note that they could be different. The second step is to install the S3FS-FUSE package. For the ease of this demo, I have already created the Linux instance. First, connect to the OCI Linux instance. You need to install the S3FS-FUSE package before installing the S3FS-FUSE file. You need to enable the Oracle Appeal repository. Otherwise, you may hit an error like error unable to find a match. First, enable Oracle Appeal repository. Edit the Appeal repository file. Press I for insert mode. Do changes in line change enabled 0 to enabled 1. To save, press escape key colon WQ exclamation mark. Verify the changes run command. Installing package directly using YUM install for S3FS-FUSE the output is installed, complete. The third step is configure credentials and mounting the file system. Create password file for S3FS. We'll create a file in the home directory file path and name. Run command will be press I for insert mode. Need to put access key ID colon secret access key. Give permission to file Run command should show CHMOD 600. Verify the permission as now we will mount bucket. Create mount point command MKDIR mount bucket. Need to run the command where we give bucket or name mount point namespace and region. Finally, let's verify. Run the command DF hyphen H capital T will mount bucket. Create the test file and verify in the console. Go to the mount point directory. Create the test.txt file using the command Thanks for watching. Please contact OCI support if you still need assistance.